In the previous lecture, in the configuration step, you have used the filter method that filters out all the even numbers given a lambda expression. In this lecture, you will learn how to use the map method which will allow you to manipulate or change the content of the values in the underlying collection. Create a new class. Call it upper to lower case. As the name says, you are going to create a collection, a list of uppercase strings, and then you will use the map method to convert them into lowercase. Select the main method, finish. Create a list of strings. L1 is equal to new array list. Add few strings to it. Once you import the list, L1 dot add within double quotes all capital John L1 dot add within double quotes please add your name I am adding my name Bharat L1 dot add within double quotes Jim use the stream API L L1 dot stream is the method that returns as the stream of the underlying collection dot use the map method this time which will take a function you can express it as a lambda expression s lambda arrow mark s dot to uppercase so we are taking a string and returning a string where s is of type uppercase we are converting it to uppercase dot collect collector dot to list collectors dot to list because we are working with lists here save it assign this control one assign statement to a new local variable call it l2 sys out l2 and before this you can also use sysout l1 print out the list before the mapping happens run the program java application and the output i have used two uppercase we should be using two lowercase we have want to convert it from uppercase to lowercase run it again and we have all uppercase to start with and then it got converted to all lowercase names so the l1 dot stream gives the stream of the underlying collection then we are using the map method that can convert each element in the underlying collection given a function to it we are passing in a function as a lambda expression given a string we are converting that string to a lowercase by invoking the string dot to lowercase method dot collect will take all the elements after the conversion and it will put inside a collection and that collection we want is a list that is the reason we are using collectors dot to list